John Abnett, who wrote and directed this series, um, we've he actually casted me in the first pilot I ever tested for, which was really cool. And so we've we've worked together on some projects since then. And so he got in touch with me and said, "I have this role I'm thinking about. I'm wondering if you wanna wanna do it." And of course, I'll I'd, I'd, I'd do anything for John. He's so great. I love working with him. We're turned around on the 50 over here. Very nice. Sure. Very nicely done, everybody. Oh. Well, John is one of the last great characters in show business. He, uh, he says of himself that he makes a great second impression, and he's probably the most collaborative person I've ever met. All right, uh, Completely in control, and at the same time, he'll always give everyone a chance to do the, their version and then tweak that. Even though he wrote it, it's like he gives it away. The second he walks on the set, he gives it away to the actors, which is a very generous thing to do. Okay, so what we're going to do now is something fun. We're going to get on the, uh, I think either the 75 or the 100. We'll pick up the phone being picked out. We'll be on track over here, and we'll roll. So like, if you don't One of the fun things about wigs is that you often get an opportunity to work with people right. who you right. haven't worked with or you have, and perhaps putting them in a role that they haven't you know, had an opportunity to do before. I don't mind. Man, nursing all day, that's enough. Yeah, why shouldn't I care for the one person I love more than anyone on the planet? Sarah Jones, I have worked with twice before. She uh, has such a sense of truthfulness that I thought she could you know, be someone who could inhabit this world, which we refer to as kind of the twilight, the twilight room. I have this expression, particularly for actors, which is when you create a character, what you want is for the shadow of the character to enter the room before the character. You live in this twilight room, you're like a shadow. Who are you? What are you? I think she has the ability to imply a tremendous amount and has a great economy in terms of word and gesture. I don't want to talk about it anymore. I've already said too much. You know, to have had the experiences Kendra had in the war and to have uh, the experiences of being in this room, this would be something that she might be able to really bring a lot to, and I think she did. Well, I'm making him an appointment and he's coming. I am calm, you should see when I'm not. And now if you know Jonesy at all, she's a, she's a charger. I mean, she goes in there and she prepares herself and she comes ready to do her job and her work and she did with this. I'm a nurse in a recovery room with a patient and his wife. Now I told you in a few minutes this will all be over and he'll be back to normal. One more time from the top. Why don't you go to Jason? Let her take you to Jason. Jason Isaacs is one of my favorite actors. He's also one of my favorite people. He, he's just uh, irrepressibly alive. Uh, I think he's quite a brilliant actor. Uh, he's just one of the most entertaining people, and uh, it, I find it a pleasure to work with him. When he performs, you know, he just gives you a lot of choices, and he's a gifted, classically trained actor. Uh, and knowing him, I know that he, uh, you know, has a lot of colors that he doesn't play all the time. And he's also so bright. He had three uh, notes in the rehearsals, which my first instinct, notwithstanding the fact that I think of myself as quite a collaborative director and a very good listener, I went, ah, ah, ah. Well, all three of them were great. And I ended up not only changing them, but uh, augmenting things because of those notes. Oh, Jason cut. wrote that. Cutting, cutting, <laughs> Jason Isaacs. And John throws a party and everybody comes, you know? He's, uh, he's, uh, very uh, paternal, maternal, you know, mensch. He, he, uh, he loves actors and he, he loves to play with actors. He, he just, he throws a beautiful picnic and everybody comes and uh, does their thing, you know. Eats a beautiful meal. 